Welcome to The Sugar Monkey. My name is Jennifer Reed, and today I'm going to show you how to make a citrus berry trifle. Strawberries, sugar, eggs, baking powder, flour, orange juice, butter, vegetable oil, confectioner's sugar, mascarpone cream, heavy cream, whipped stiff, an orange, fresh basil, and a vanilla bean. To get started with our citrus berry trifle, we're gonna make the macerated strawberries. It's essential that you make this the day ahead. Cut off the stems and remove the holes. And we're just gonna put them, just like this, into a bowl. We're gonna put the sugar over top and we're just gonna toss them to coat. Cover it nice and tight with plastic wrap. You're gonna put it over a water bath. Be very, very careful that your water is only simmering. The strawberries need to cook for about 20 minutes. They're gonna look like this. We're just gonna leave them covered and we're gonna let them sit until they're room temperature. Once the strawberries are room temperature, we're gonna put them in the refrigerator overnight. Let's get baking. Next, we're gonna make the chiffon cake. Just start whisking the yolks and the sugar together. Now, we're gonna start to whisk in the orange juice slowly and then start to whisk in your oil. And we're just going to reserve this until the egg whites are whipped. So now we're gonna start to whip our egg whites. We're gonna add a third of our two tablespoons of sugar and we're gonna start the mixer. And once this gets nice and white and foamy, we're gonna add our other third. So now that the egg whites are whipped stiff, we're gonna put them into a mixing bowl and we're gonna add to that our whipped egg yolk mixture. And then we're gonna slowly sprinkle in this is the flour and the baking powder that we've sifted together. You don't want to add this too fast because you'll bit, get big clumps of flour in your cake. And we're just gonna whisk this together until it's all incorporated. And then we're gonna put it into our prepared pan. And this is going to go into a 350 degree oven for about 15 to 20 minutes. So after 15 to 20 minutes, you take it out of the oven. It's nice and golden brown. You're gonna let this come to room temperature and then you can chill it overnight. Next, we're gonna make the crispy tweel batter. This needs to be refrigerated overnight. You're gonna add your egg whites into your confectioner's sugar. You're gonna split your vanilla bean and scrape it. And this is just gonna get whisked. And now we're going to add in the flour all at once. You wanna make sure there's no lumps. Now, we're gonna slowly stream in the butter so it's all mixed in. And then this, you can just reserve overnight in the refrigerator covered. So after your twill batter has chilled overnight, you're gonna take it and we're gonna spread it onto a nonstick sheet tray. You can do this in any shape that you would like. So these are gonna go into a 375 degree oven for three to five minutes and until they're golden brown. So our twills have just come out of the oven. They're still warm, but we wanna take them off of our tray anyway. As soon as they're cool, you're gonna put them in an airtight container and store them until you're ready to use them. Next, we're gonna make the mascarpone cream. We have our mascarpone and our confectioner's sugar in a bowl. We're gonna take the quarter of a vanilla bean. We're gonna split it and scrape it. We're just gonna mix this together until it's smooth. Then we're just gonna fold in the heavy cream and we're just folding it until it all becomes even color. And we're just gonna put this in the refrigerator and reserve it until we're ready to use it. The last step is to assemble the trifle. You're going to cut out your chiffon cake into your desired shape. And because it's Valentine's Day, we're gonna make little hearts. You can do three or four pieces of cake per trifle. So now we're just gonna pipe a little cream on the plate. You can stick your hearts on. We're putting our orange segments on, and now we're gonna put on a couple of our macerated strawberries. We're gonna put on a couple fresh strawberries, too. We're gonna put on a little bit of basil. We're just gonna spoon a little bit of the juice over the top. This is our citrus berry trifle. You can try making it at home, or you can order it from me at the Sugar Monkey. This is for your margarita that you're gonna need. Don't see what I'm doing, okay? <laughs>